Right. We have... Good morning, Madam Chair. My name is Mervyn Chetty from Licensing and Compliance, and we've got Kevin Smith, who is the Manager for Business Support. Thank you. So I will, right. I will make a few comments, and then happy to take <coughs> questions uh, on this matter. Yep. Uh, so some opening comments. The new Food Act uh, comes into effect on 1st of March 2016 for the three-year transition period. Uh, the Act introduces an efficient uh, national uh, food safety uh, system and it places an obligation on the business operators uh, and businesses uh, to be responsible for the efficient and safe and suitable supply of food across New Zealand. Uh, the Act also provides for TAs to uh, establish and fix fees for the duties that it discharges under the Act, <coughs> and the duties include uh, registration activities, monitoring activities, and verification activities. <coughs> Prior to fixing the fees, we would need to go through a special consultative process, and so the timing of the special consultative process is not ideal, but uh, we have little choice in the matter as we have, need to have the fees in place by the 1st of March next year. Our proposed fee regime is consistent with other fees and charges um, established by Auckland Council, and it's also consistent with uh, uh, other TAs and with MPI as well. So we're looking for adoption of the statement of proposal so we can start the consultation process. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I'm move, Madam Chair. Moved by Councillor Penrose, seconded by Councillor Cashmore, through. and Councillor Cashmore. Madam Chair, at the um, auditor's report for this past year, there were some issues identified with the food process checking. So you have incorporated the recommendations of the auditor and also the recommendations that we put in place and actually actioned into these proposed new fees and charges that can all be solved within this, these options packages? Yes, so we, we are uh, developing and implementing a quality management system to deal with the findings from the auditor's report. And so the, the cost for that has been incorporated into these proposed fees and charges. Thank you. Thank you. Member Taipari. Well, Kia ora, Madam Chair. I was um, seeking to propose an amendment um, which you get up, and it was principally around marais uh, and uh, the policy relating to those, particularly to customary preparation of food, versus um, the commercial aspect and was proposing that um, the committee agree that the Food Act uh, fee policy recognise the non-for-profit role of marae by providing for exemptions or reductions in the fee or by a system that differentiates the change according to certain criteria being scaled income or other factors and I know that you've been working through the process of that uh, so I'm very keen to uh, forward that amendment um, for that consideration around this policy. Uh, do you have any issues with that or concerns with that? So essentially the, the provisions of the Act, it, it exempts uh, any food uh, prepared and served in the Marae for customary activities mm -hmm. anyway. So the only um, area where the Act will, will come into effect is where food is, is, is sold for, for profit. Okay. So the policy will address that? Yeah. yeah. So, so that would be the same for any non-for-profit? Yeah, I'm yes, okay. yes. We'll there's, there's no difference. I don't think we need your amendment. Yeah, we'll pick that up for the process, Madam Chair. Yeah. Right, right to be moved and seconded. Oh, Councillor Walker. I, I just had a question, um, and I don't know whether it covers this, but in a situation where there's some, um, mm. some fish being caught and, and the fish is then being distributed to a, um, a number of uh, people, may not technically be sold some form of system. Does that come under this, under the gambit of, of this? No, if, it's, if there's no commercial transaction, then it wouldn't fit. So there has to be a commercial transaction, yes. and that commercial transaction would be just defined under common law. Yes. Right, thank you. I'm going to put the recommendation. All those in favour? Aye. 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 Against, carried. Thank you. Thank you, thank you very much. Thank you.